The horrifying true story behind the girl in the basement. Part 2. Elizabeth Fritzl tried to make life for her children as normal as possible. She painted animals on the basement's walls to try to bring some joy and cheer to her children. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a purple octopus right back by the toilet. But not all of Elizabeth's children lived with her in the basement. Although all of her children were born in the basement, the three older ones stayed down in the basement with Elizabeth, whereas the three younger ones went upstairs. Joseph had strategically placed the three younger children in baskets near bushes, or on the porch. And each of the babies came with notes saying that they were Elizabeth's and that Elizabeth could not raise them. And that gave Rosemary, Elizabeth's mother, the false impression that Elizabeth had indeed run away and then got pregnant and then just went back to the house to drop off her babies because she couldn't raise them. And because Joseph had Elizabeth write these notes, they were in Elizabeth's handwriting and Rosemary believed it. So it was actually Rosemary and Joseph who raised Elizabeth's three younger children. And those children had normal lives that consisted of school, going outside, playing 